uh, the playlist I have made on benzene and its compounds that I talk about how nitrobenzene is formed from the electrophilic substitution reaction. So you can refer to that, uh, those videos to check, check this out. But for now we have nitrobenzene and we reduce it uh, in this reaction to get phenylamine. So I just make the structure of phenylamine. This is the, uh, I attach an NH2 group over here. So as you can see, the only difference between nitrobenzene and phenylamine is that instead of O2, we have H2. The end remains the same. The oxygen atoms have been replaced by hydrogen atoms. So this is nitrobenzene, nitrobenzene. Uh, just a second. Yeah, nitrobenzene over here. We have talked about this before in the benzene and its compounds playlist. So if you wa if you watch that, uh, you should know from there. Nitrobenzene. And here we have phenylamine. So, uh, as you can see, uh, the, when we balance this equation, we release two H2O, but this is the reaction and these are the reagents and conditions for it. So you have to remember this. Now let's move for, further. So reactions of phenylamine. So there are two characteristic reactions of phenylamine that we will be studying and they are very important. One is the reaction of phenylamine with bromine. And the other is the formation of dyes. So uh, we've all seen dyes, colored dyes, we dye our hair and everything. But how are those dyes formed? So that's what we are going to learn. So, so first we are doing the formation. Uh, uh, so the reaction of phenylamine with bromine. So the reagents are aqueous bromine and phenylamine. No conditions required for this reaction. And what we get is basically, as if I write an equation, let me make phenylamine, when we react this with bromine, we get H2 and in the 2, 4 and 6 positions we get bromine Br so this is a 2, 4, 6 tribromophenylamine yeah the name sounds very complicated but I'll write it for you Two, four, six, tribromo because three bromines. The two, four, six because we know the positions of the bromine measured from the position of NH two, which is taken as one. Two, four, six, tribromo, phenylamine. So as you can see. This is very similar to what formed uh, when we reacted bromine with phenol. So this tells a lot about phenol and phenylamine. Uh, phenol and phenylamine are both very reactive uh, substances. Uh, and um, if you want, if you go back to my video on benzene, benzene and its compounds, the playlist on benzene and its compounds, then you will see that phenol undergoes a similar reaction with bromine and it is directed to the 2, 4, 6 positions because both NH2 and OH are electron donating groups. So they activate the 2, 4 and 6 groups, uh, 2, 4 and 6 positions, sorry. So they activate the 2, 4 and 6 positions and that's why we have the bromine atoms on the 2, 4 and 6 positions. And the observation uh, for this reactions are, the observations for this reaction is bromine water decolorizes, which means it goes from orange to colorless 
and a white precipitate which is 246 tribromophenylamine forms. So this is the white precipitate 